Let's talk about integration in business because I feel like a lot of people aren't talking about that. And no, I don't mean the integrations between like your email provider and your payment provider. I'm talking about the integration in actually like taking all this shit that you're learning from the million webinars you're doing and actually implementing them into your business. I see so many brilliant, amazing women jumping on to do all these masterclasses and trainings and educations and online membership and like no judgment. It's amazing. I have an online membership too. The difference between my online membership and a lot of the ones I see out there is that we have a monthly focus topic compared to like, sometimes I see four focus topics a week. Here's the difference with that and why that's important. If you are spending all your income producing hours, all your money making time in your business, all your workable hours watching webinars and jumping on calls in your business where is the time to actually implement the things that you're learning from the calls and it's it's great like one day they've got a call about tech and the next day they've got a call about seo and the day after that they've got a call about facebook ads and you're spending so much time on calls and so much time watching master classes and webinars and trainings that you're not actually actioning anything in your business and you can look back at the end of 12 months and be like oh my god i learned all this stuff and i'll be like yes but babe what did you do what did you do? What did you actually implement? All that learning that you've done, how have you actually integrated that into your business? Like you learned about public relations, amazing. Did you actually implement a strategy for public relations? And this is why in my membership, we have a monthly focus topic and we have two group coaching calls a month, not multiple group coaching calls a week is to actually give you the space to go away and implement what I'm teaching you. Like between this call and the next call, here are the things you should do. This whole month, here are the action steps that you should take. Because I believe usual time is so precious, especially if you're a woman in business. If you're a mum in business like me, I've got three kids, your time is so precious. You need time to actually do the things you're learning about. You need to actually spend time doing the things in your business implementing strategies, growing it, creating content, and like get off so many webinars and so many masterclasses and start doing the things you're learning about. And there'll be different ebbs and flows in your business. I, I certainly am always educating myself and always doing personal development, but not at a detriment to actually doing the work I need to do in my business and actually implementing the strategies I'm learning. Like, it's great if you can sit back and be like, I read 40 books this year. And I'm like, great, but what did you actually do and implement and change in your life from those 40 books? Because if you're just ticking the box to say you've ticked the box, what is the point, you know?